But I wrote the song about Harry, and then back then, Victory Music was doing at their open mics what they would call the featurette. And it was my turn to be a featurette, and it was in July of that same year. But we were all down at the A&T, and that day was just a beautiful summer's day, not a cloud in the sight. And the Helpmate St. Helens uh, shot off about three plumes into outer space. And so I remember Dick and I were at the counter talking, and some of the people started making racket, and we turned around, and we could see, looking through the windows, that so we all ran out, and the, the traffic stopped at this big, huge intersection there. Everybody got out of their cars, and you're looking across the horizon at it, you know, rising. And in about two minutes, you were looking like this, like your head was straight up looking. And I just looked at Dick, and I said, it just, it just blew that cloud into outer space. It just changed forever what I think big is, you know? <laughs> and, uh, and so uh, I thought, well, you know, old Harry, that was his love. So this is a... Uh, and I had a... Uh, there was the Hippie's Last Stand last year up in uh, Carbonado, and I had the chance to come up there and play this song that night. Good old Harry Truman Washed away your soul, they say By Helen's Not St. Helen's Keeper of the spirit man The only thing that he could not take Was leaving People ask why don't you go That mountain top is sure he said, I know, thanks, but right now I'm kind of busy. More than 50 years, here he lived the mountain life, he knew the fears. But he and Edna made their way, they made it through fires and winds. Top is sure to blow. Harry said, you know, maybe you better go. Take my neighbors with you. <laughs> with a patient watch for weeks on end, while Helen's puffed and spewed again and again. Then it started to swell and tilt, but no one more than a said he had his own hidey hole and a gallon of whiskey to ease the blow. Don't you know? Where so they say, the hell is Mount St. 
Então.